Hey guys, this is Swordfish. Today I'm playing Morrowind, and this guy's really getting up in my grill. Alright, Galtus. So, um, in the last episode I did some dastardly deeds, and it's time to do some more. Looking for some jobs. Gendosa Arabar is a counselor's daughter, if you know what I mean. I've never heard daughter used in an innuendo phrase before, but I guess it's the first time for everything. I hear she's got a copy of Boethia's Pillow Book. Well, I have a copy of Boethia's Pillow Book, and I found it in Arabar Manor. Well, I have a client that wanted some dirt on the Arabar family. Would you be willing to part with the book? Yeah, what's a good, what good is it to me? Interesting books these Dunmar have. We're getting paid well for this job. I looked over the emergency supplies and found a ring and an amulet you might like. Fantastic, I just did a quest by accident. That couldn't be any better. All right, goodbye. And advancement? I am a bandit. You are now Swordfish the Bandit. Fantastic. Any more jobs? There's another book you want to fetch. It's called Withershins. Another client wants us to find a copy of this book for him. It's not for sale, if you know what I mean. He likes that phrase. I've heard that Miles Gloriosus over at the Andes Trade House in Margon has a copy. Margon? Where is Margon? Is that... That is not a place that I remember having ever been, unless he's talking about the name of a store. Seems like... Maybe... Wait. Okay, let me... Let me see here. Let me head outside. And see if that is if that is a thing here. The Aldscar Inn, the Council Club, the Guilds. These are houses. Doesn't seem like Margon is a place the Margon Trade House Margon Andes Trade House in Margon well I guess I have to figure out where that is and then go there as it turns out Margon is a town nearby here that is reachable by Siltstrider. So, I'm sorry this big buggo, buggo creature has to go off in this crazy storm, but he's getting paid. That is an awesome detail right there. He's shading his eyes from the dust. That is fantastic. Let's go to Mark on. If this isn't a sister city, I don't know what is. Looks like we never left. All right, let me put my hands away. That's creepy. Um, now I'm looking for Andes Trade House. This is probably an inn. Margon Outpost. Okay. Do you know about? Let's see. Margon. We're in a place. Monsters have been. This is interesting. There's a the ghost fence. Monsters have been breaking through the ghost fence. Uh, which is a thing nearby. I'm assuming that has something to do with this. I don't know, though. I don't know. I don't know a lot. Because I don't read as much as I should. Okay. I am going to take a little jolly stroll through Margon and see if I can find myself the trade post. And a straight house. Okay. Now... And he said it wasn't for sale if I know what he meant. I think I have to steal it. Especially since it's a Thieves Guild quest. This guy is frightening. I have to talk to you. Services? I want your services because you are one scary dude. Okay. Miles Glor- Yeah, of course, it's this book, right? Um... Miles Glorious, this guy's. Is he the one who has a copy? Yeah, he, he does. 
Margon, I don't know what Margon. Armor, he's an armor. Little secret? Okay, stuff. I'm not interested in you, I'm interested in your book. There's not any of these. It's probably in this chest if we're if we're being honest here. It's in a, it's locked somewhere. It's in one of these locked things. Now my my invisibility spell, I think, is out of charge. I used it today, so that's I have to I have to sleep to use it again. I do have invisibility potions though. And those I won't have to sleep for. So why not? Let's try it. Standard invisibility. Drink it. And I'm invisible. And so let's open this chest. Uh, Grandmaster pick. Unlocked. And... Wither shins. Wait, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. I... Well... The invisibility worked to unlock the chest, but he was looking at me while I, I guess, opened the chest, so... Let me do that again. Let me unlock it, and then save again. Now, I think that little icon on the bottom left means I am not being watched. That is correct. All right. Well done, well done, thief. Um, that wasn't too hard. I can feel my shins withering beneath me. Now let me head on home. Well, not home. I'm a homeless adventurer, I cannot head home. Let me head back and see if I can get some credit for this adventure. Beneath Red Mountain, Lord Dagoth sleeps, but when he wakes, we all shall rise, and the dust will blow away. Serve your Lord Dagoth, or the Sixth House's resident Dagoth is its glory. That's how I imagined he would have said that. That was not very hard. Okay, let's see how he feels about it. Wither shins. Here it is. This is the right thousand septums for that. That was so easy. For four more jobs. Okay, let's do some more jobs. Got some Dwemer Spider Centurions from a friend. And we got SR Till who we can fix them up, but we don't have any scrap metal. You can find scrap metal in most Dwemer ruins. You need four pieces of scrap metal. Well, that's a very specific thing. Didn't I find a bunch of scrap metal in a Dwemer ruin and sell it to the guy in Balmora? I think I did, so I'm going to head there and see. It's like returning home coming back to Balmora. I remember it well. It's been so long. Alright, Revere. Do you still have my scrap metal? What do you think? Got a whole bunch of crap, but is this... Is it gone? It might be. Um... I think it might be gone. Let me comb through this. As I thought, it's all gone. So, I am gonna have to find myself a Dwemer Ruin and hunt for some scrap metal. Now that's not, that doesn't strike me as the super easiest thing to do, unless they're just everywhere. So I'm gonna have to look that up. I think and see what's nearby well I was looking on the Morrowind wiki for Dwemer ruins and then I said why don't I look up for scrap metal and I learned that now Kyra of Whitehaven carries scrap metal illegally in her shop. Now we are already thieves here. So I don't mind buying an illegal product. I'm just gonna go steal it anyway. So I figured I would come here 
and buy it from her. So, I have to drop the skooma first. Okay. Um, that's magic. Skooma. All right, now let's pretend that's not there. Barter, you have 10 scrap metal somewhere. Some somewhere. Where is it? Where is it? I don't see it. I also don't know what it looks like. Scrap metal, there it is. Wait, how much do I need? I need four. Sure. Scrap metal. I want four pieces. Thank you very much. And let me barter you down on that a little bit. No, okay, just kidding. That was easy. And I am over encumbered. Because that was heavy. Okay, let me take care of this. I have all these extravagant clothes to sell this guy. And I have all these books to sell this lady. And I have some armor to sell this fellow. And I'm gonna offload my skooma to Revere. And now I should be way good on my weight and I can pick up the scrap metal and return to finish the quest. It is a nice clear day here in Aldrun. No sandstorms. It's a little cloudy, but visibility is high, as they would say. And let me just go. People, you really shouldn't stand on the stairs. It's really rude. Let us just go bring this to this fella. Scrap metal. I did. You found some, eh? Well, I'll give you a fair price for it. How about 250 septums each? That is way more than I paid for it. That was easy. Advancement? Do some more jobs. Nah, not right now. Because that is all for this episode. But, uh, thank you very much for watching, as always, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!